talking, of course, about uh, <laughs> I had <laughs> I had to split this poster in two, and it doesn't look uh, <laughs> it doesn't look very very great when split that way. It was a uh, it was a long boy. But yeah, we're looking at the uh, the original Breakers, a game that uh, I, I okay. So I I wasn't sure like the best way to cover this because uh, I mean this is this is the original Breakers, and nobody nobody plays this version. Everybody plays Revenge because Revenge is pretty much the same game except with one new character and one new boss code. So there's really uh, Breakers is still a fine game on its own. It's still a fine game on its own. It's just, uh, it kind of got completely invalidated by what happened later with Revenge. It does have that CD version. We will look at that. But uh, I, I almost wanted to do both games at once, but I think we'll just wait until uh, until Revenge uh, comes around again on, on 1998. Uh, Spartan Bear, I don't think that was, that was Twitch being fucked up. That was me forgetting to change the, uh, the go live notification for Monday. So it said that on Wednesday and it might have, might have thrown people off, even though Wednesday's always, like, uh, labbing up of arcade games. But, uh, there's some, there's some English here. Lee Dow Rong. Is Condor's last name Heads? I don't remember. <laughs> But actually, what I should also, uh, we should also mention, mention, uh, is that Breakers had a a weird uh, development history. Talked about this like very briefly, or not very briefly, but uh, showed off like a uh, a video that's been floating around, or I guess there's like multiple videos now of the uh, the original prototype version of Breakers, which was called uh, Crystal Legacy, or <laughs> Or Ten Tenrin no Ryo Chicago on the Japanese version for some reason, and unfortunately we can't really I can't really make any uh, any judgments on Crystal Legacy because you know the the ROMs aren't out there they're still being uh, they're still being hoarded. I mean there is video and from the video that's been uh, that's been floating around uh, this early version of Breakers looked really really rough. Like it does not look anywhere near as fast and as fluid as the uh, as what breakers would become. Like it looks more like uh, like like it's supposed to play like art of fighting with like the uh, the screen zooming in and zooming out, and the game having it, it. It looks like the game has like no combos. Like everything looks like mad negative on hit. Nothing hits. Nothing combos during hit stun. Shit like that. So it it looks really awful. I'd like to play it myself just to, you know, pass judgment on it. But yeah, Crystal Legacy was supposed to come out in like um I want to say like the summer of 94. It was like featured in an issue of like EGM at the time. Like they did a they had like some fighting game cover around the time like Super Turbo came out and like Crystal Legacy got like a a short blurb in there. So it was like mentioned in an English magazine along with all the uh, all the Japanese coverage, but uh, I guess they uh, they might have put it on location test. Players said, "Nah, this sucks," and then it kind of kind of got canned. But uh, Visco didn't want to give up on it. They felt there was uh, uh, there was some merit to the game, and they just needed to they needed to spend a little more time in the oven. They had to make an engine that didn't play like shit. And what we got out of it was uh, was breakers. It took them like uh, I guess like two and a half years to fix it, but uh, uh, I think it was worth it in the end. But this this has led to the uh, uh, I, I guess like when, when 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 this game came out, like it didn't really like get much attention either. Uh, I never saw this in a, in an arcade. I don't know how many people actually did see it in an arcade. It didn't really, uh, didn't really get much traction. It feels like most of the traction this game gained were like in the years like following emulation, when people were like able to try it out and say like, "Hey, this game's actually pretty fun." Anyway, let's uh, let's get right into it. Hold on, I'm using like a different version of Mame here. 
Alright, that's that looks good. Visco and their terrible audio quality. What's up, Gibby? This game is every every Visco game is like really low in volume compared to like everything else that runs on the Neo Geo. I don't understand why. God, this sounds really bad. <laughs> Nice, uh, nice demo. Yeah, the <laughs> the round clear jingle is the loudest thing in this game. It's almost as bad as like the Super Nintendo version of uh, Nice in the Round. All right, let's. Uh, apparently, I've played this a few times. Actually, wait, was there like anything I needed to? That looks good. Alright, let's go. Walk front and back. Up to jump. Down to crouch. Yep. A button's light punch, B button's light kick. C button heavy punch, D button heavy kick. Standard four button controls. There's also like combinations of buttons you can do. That kind of depend on the character. Like a lot of characters have an A and C attack or a, a B and D. Some have like a B and C. So I got I got eight characters. Not a not a huge number for a fighting game in 1996, but of course I'm gonna play my girl Ryla. <laughs> Ryla's a charge character. So if you are if you are familiar with revenge, like some things might look a little weird, like the uh, the life bars are yellow instead of blue. Also, there's like some uh, some changes in like the background colors and stuff like that. Yeah, that got really loud. And yeah, the uh, the artwork's different. The character with ratio is different. Slushy. Oh. Yeah. No. <laughs> but yeah, different. Uh, Different uh, windscreen and character select portrait sets. That's kind of about it. Like, okay, yeah, the things that, the thing I've heard, like a couple people mention, is that like this game supposedly has some, some or, or revenge has like some balance changes from the original game. Nobody's mentioned what they are. Like, <laughs> if there are like actual balance changes in the original version of Breakers, I would like to know what they are. I would like it out on the record. But nobody, everybody keeps saying, like, yeah, there's balance changes, but what the fuck are they? You win. 20 years of people saying the versions are different with zero proof. Yeah, that sounds about right. Round two, fight. So I would, I would like to get it out there. Those breakers have breaks. Okay, so... There, there is one thing in this game's engine that wasn't really, uh, wasn't really mentioned in the the how to play demo, and I guess it's gonna be hard for me to to show off with Ryla. Is this game's got a a weird feature uh, where if you're if you're either blocking or getting hit by an attack, you can reduce like block stun or hit stun by like mashing out a special move. So you kind of, it's kind of like an alpha counter, but you can also do it do it during hit stun, and it can be done like at any time. 
It doesn't work so well for like uh, a character like Ryla who has a charge attack and can't really mash, so it's kind of it's kind of weird to show off. But you can also, I think like everybody can like backdash as a breaker also. And so this makes a this makes a lot of uh, a lot of the long combos in this game like not actual combos if they actually like <laughs> if if your opponent like knows how to break her. Yeah, I can't really show it off against computer because I don't know what the fuck they're gonna do. I'm trying to like backdash when I block something, but I don't know what the fuck Alcyon's doing. This game's AI also gets very, very rude in later stages, so... Oops, I missed my combo. Oh, that low profile is it. Well, there goes my big bonus. If you're playing this game for score, like, <laughs> the way to play for score is, like, never lose a round. I just lost a round. Yeah, I'll see him wander around. It's amazing what can happen when the computer has, like, a damage buff. Also, I keep trying to show off the break ring, but I can't <laughs> I can't get the computer to do what I want it to do. Sandra, so in mirror matches against the computer, the other uh, the computer clone will have like a different name and different color palette. The Sandra name was was Ryla's name during Crystal Legacy. I don't know why they did that, but uh, most of the names are the same. Some of them were changed. Oh god! Take a flash kick. This game also has some weird stuff going on in the engine in regards to like damage. Like the amount of damage you do with any one attack is uh, is reliant on like. Uh, <laughs> how do I explain this? There's like kind of a wow, the computer's talking to me. There's kind of a comeback mechanic where if you haven't landed an attack in a while, your next attack is going to do more damage. So if the computer, if if the opponent's like doing a lot of damage to you, and you haven't gotten to land a hit in a while, and then you land like one one standing heavy punch, it might do like 20% damage or something. It's it's kind of weird. Round one, fight! Marvelous Morrow. Uh oh. Jesus Christ. Come on. Gotta mash for more hits on that. Oh god. That was not a link. That's a lick. I probably could have breakered that. I want to do a breaker against like a multi-hitting move, but like I said, I could... Wow, taunt! Throw in the taunt! Computer's feeling itself. Oh, wow. Dodge the now. Uh oh. Not a oh. Usually the computer's pretty stupid about uh, running into that lion super, but not that time. Why was much stronger? So the show is pretty much like the best character in the game. He's got an amazing rush down. He can he can he can zone out. He's got one of the best breakers in the game. I guess in the original breakers, like <laughs> Show would be number one, and Tia's probably number two. Condor might be third. Especially since uh, Condor doesn't have to worry about side zone in this game. 
then like Ryla and Dao Long after that. Computer loves doing throw in the taunt. Yep, Show's got the ability to do uh, five jumping light punches in a row. Because why not? Let's give him everything except the command throw. You can actually do like multiple light punches and then combo into his uh, air fireball super. There's no Baihu code in this, no. Baihu's completely unplayable unless you use main cheese. I don't think he's playable in the CD version either. Unless there's like a different code. Wow. Nice auto fire. Oh. Oh my god. So keep mashing C. Come on. There we go. Jump her in. Thank you for the 28 months. Happy New Year. It's like January 9th already. But yeah, Tia's super solid too. She's kind of a Shoto too. She's got a Fireball. She's got a Dragon Punch. She's got a... Not really a Hurricane Kick. It's like a bat. It's like a Wheel Kick. You can do it in midair. She's got really good rush down. Um, getting bodied. Nice. But because of the comeback factor, one hit's gonna kill me. I'm just gonna keep doing this. Oh, that's an overhead. The first hit of that's an overhead. She's gonna Psycho Crusher Super for some reason. <laughs> I didn't mean to mash that out. Spinning claws and mash move. Oh, Psycho Crusher. Come on. Keep doing line super. When in doubt, just hit the Crouching Heavy Punch with Ryla. That's the that's a good button. Where haven't I fought yet? Oh, PL. PL! Nobody knows what happened to uh, PL's voices in this game. He just uh, he just turned up like that. Oh yeah, he's from he's from Italy in this game. There's the Italian flag back there. Even though his name is PL. They changed it to the French flag in Revenge. For some reason, it's showing the, the Italian flag back there. This goes uh, very confused. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. That's supposed to be super. Uh oh. Uh -huh. Oh, that actually got him out. I can't backdash that. Yeah, maybe we're just fighting in a, an Italian restaurant in France. Who knows? Who knows? Alright, final stage. By who? He's the, uh, he's the boss character. He's got, uh, uh, all his, uh, well, if he was actually playable in this game, but he's not. Uh, all his special moves are, like, button inputs. Like, Ed in Street Fighter V, I guess. This is a, he's kind of a, a rough opponent if you try to fight him legit. But, uh, I got the strat. Two, fight! Nice. Oh, that's supposed to whiff. Oh, head stomp! Head stomp! Oh god. I gotta land a knockdown, there we go. 
Yeah, give me that. Give me that damage. I guess some of those attacks I could have breakered. Yeah, they... It's very lucky that there's a... Uh... Uh, <laughs> you can you can bait him into doing the most uh, punishable move, because a lot of his shit is very safe. The dress she bought with the prize she won. She didn't. <laughs> the prize money only bought one dress. That sounds like uh, FGC pots. I guess someone might. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna finish that joke. I'm not gonna finish that joke. <laughs> Heidi knew where I was going with that. I'm not going to finish that joke. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I got to edit this part out. Video's just going to cut right here. <laughs> um, hey, yeah, that was a, that was a 1cc. Yeah, not a, not a very long game, of course, because you've got eight stages and one boss. Let me see if I can, like, get the, uh, if I can actually do the breaker in thing. Maybe I can, uh, let's see, I need, like, a, a multi-hitting special move. A multi-hitting super. Yeah, I'm not editing out shit. I don't have any <laughs> video editing skills. Just fucking upload all this shit to YouTube. Fuck it. Just export to YouTube and done. <laughs> game over. Game over. It's a weird game over screen. Okay, who's got like a... Um, oh wait, hold on. I, I think I need to change my buttons. Since I'm using joystick... No, I'm using joystick button one. Oh wait, no, I have to like redo that. Um... Who's got an easy multi-hitting move? I guess Marl's got that spinning thing. Oh wait, no, PL's got that, that spinning thing too. Round one. Okay, so I have hey. to... Uh... What's the motion for this? Are my buttons even set right? This is hard to do on keyboard for me. Okay, that's how you do it. Alright. Let's get him in the corner. And then block. Okay, so you can't break her like in between hits, but... Wait, did that not, uh... Man, this is hard to do by myself. I guess I could do a super. Okay, pause there. Okay, it's, it's hard to see, but there's like a, uh... There's like a little circle that appears when at the at the bottom around like Sho's feet when he does the uh, the breaker. You saw that like green circle that appeared on the ground. So if I do it normally, the green circle doesn't appear. But yeah, if you see the green circle, that means you successfully did a breaker. Condor is really good about this too because uh, uh, like Condor has a. A 360 grab. And so if you're in block stun, you can just start spinning the joystick and doing 360s. Uh, let's see. I know Marl's got that spinny thing. Round one, fight. What's the motion for that again? Yeah, that. 
Bless you. Wait, that's not it. Can't. Okay. Let's save that. Oh. That's a bad time to do it. Man. I cannot do special moves in this game. On keyboard. Okay. No, that's too far. Well, anyway, Condor can do, uh, can do 360s if they're, like, uh, if they're doing, like, an unsafe, uh, an unsafe block string. But that also means, that, like, that, like, some combos in this game that you see in, like, combo videos are not, like, actual combos. If the computer knows how to break her, because, like, Show's got some, like, really, some really ridiculous combo. I don't know if I, if I remember how to do it, but it's, like, uh... That. Linking after that. When you hit B and C, he does this weird, like, jumping look at that knee attack. And if you space it right, like, it shows up on the combo counter like that. And so if you look at, like, combo videos on YouTube, it's like, oh, Show's got a, an infinite combo. He's broken. But there's, like, there's a gap in between those two hits. Or not a, not really a gap, but you can actually, like, shorten your, your hit stun. With a, uh, with a special move, if you have one. I'm really bad at doing this combo, by the way. <laughs> but, you, you get the point. But it's a, it's a weird mechanic that, like, not everybody knows about. And it is, it is like a legit feature they put into the game. It doesn't have a name. It just kind of got called Breakering, because it was, a the dumbest possible thing to call it, and everybody just kind of ran with it. Because you're, you're like, breaking the combo. You're breakering the combo. <laughs> Alright, well, we have to... We, ha we gotta look at the CD version, because it's got a, uh... It's got a fun little thing. Unfortunately, the, uh... Uh, the rip I have has that two-second audio delay, so, like, all the... All the audio tracks get fucked up, but that's that's fine. Uh, that's not the. Why is it out here? Load that, please. Oop. Is it loaded? Reset. The original version of Breakers did get a Neo CD version, but Breakers Revenge did not. Okay. Start it up, please. That's that a very blombie looking show. It doesn't seem like like too much like really got uh, uh, got affected in the conversion to CD. Balin wins. Other than uh, other than load times. Oh, Danbo, thank you for the forty-one months. You're welcome. You can change interval demo to be normal or simple. Let's put it on simple. Got a survival mode. So, so, so simple mode just gives them little tiny portraits so it, it loads faster. Excellent. I haven't played a survival mode on this. Let's try it out. How long? Where are you going? He's, he's going to heaven. And this is double speed loading. So that just completely skips the... Oh, wait, no, maybe survival mode skips the Versus screen. Oh, man. Pink and pink and green life bars. I like this, this watermelon-colored life bar scheme for the... for survival mode. Oops. I'm 
I'm gonna lose in stage one of survival. Music's like a, a little bit arranged. It's such a weird chibi Tia. But yeah, survival mode's not so good for CD since you gotta load like every stage, you know, every round. Tomahu! You even got like a different, uh, different colors for the combo counter too. Oh, am I gaining health with, with landed hits? Oh. Yeah, you get like a little bit of health back between stages, but... Yeah, does that mean like if you do like a multi-hit combo, if you have like a, a 20 hit super, is that gonna do, get you back more health? Watch the health bar. Yup! Yup! Huh. And the CPU gets it back too. Huh. Alright. Whoa, <laughs> that was a good... Damn, that was a good Condor face, but it loads too fast on the mirror match. Now my question is, there's only... Only nine characters. Is he gonna keep going after... After, like, the... All nine? <laughs> it says perfect, even though that wasn't actually a perfect. Always doing the balloon now. I don't like these loading screen images. <laughs> They're kind of... kind of sus. So I should always do, like, the, the 720 grab super. It gives you back more health. Hey, perfect. Definitely a well-deserved perfect. I'm gonna start speeding these up. Oh, I missed. But yeah, the music's arranged a, a little bit. Yeah, give me that health back. Nom 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 nom. Oh, but it's not a perfect. <laughs> Why do they always like walk off screen and then come back? Round one, fight! Oh, maybe this version, maybe this version of main doesn't have the two-second audio of the way. Sounds better now. Breaker that shit. Like an Egyptian. Ray, yeah, they definitely have like that 1996 oh, GeoCities GIF look to them. SK, thank you for the 73 months. X73. Thank you very much for the resub, sir. Uh -oh. What stage am I on? Six, seven. Screw it! Well, that was number eight. I think? Am I back to... I already fought Tia, right? So yeah, it's just gonna keep going until until I lose. Yeah, battle nine. I was wondering if it was one of those survival modes that like actually has an end. I love anti-air Tamahu into, uh, into Super. Tamahu is an ABC input, by the way. 
Or BCD. This has to be three buttons. ACD. ABD. Alright, let's, uh... <laughs> I need to see the end of that animation. Alright, let's just put an end to this. Come on. Not getting it perfect, though. Oh, wait, he can get it perfect. Shit. No! Winner, Gigars. Oh, I guess it's got a. Earnings? I wasn't expecting those sound effects. Alright. Oh wow, on simple it also like changes the uh the game over screen. Okay, so the other thing this game has, of course. Okay, what's the code? Down A, down A. Down D, down D, down right, left, right, up. CD down. I get told because I must. And now we get we get extra. Extra mode is here. What is extra mode, you ask? Let's play. Uh, let's play some. Let's play show. Let's play tiny show. <laughs> The versus screen looks so funny with the the little tiny uh, portraits. Actually, maybe Show's not the best character to show this off because he can just kind of do whatever he wants anyway. Anyway, extra mode gives you the ability to jump cancel anything. Do dumb juggles like this. You can actually cancel out of hit stun. You've got push blocks. I think you get ABC when you block an attack and you, you have a push block. And if you hit ABC and hit stun, you actually like bounce out. Nope, I'm not stunned. Fuck you. Oh, come. Computer knows how to cancel out. Oh god. Computer knows how to play in extra mode. Oh, that didn't combo. That combo, so. Nope. <laughs> Air attack. Wait, can he do uh I was trying to do uh, air fireball out of that. But yeah, totally, totally insane. Was only in this. Uh, <laughs> these tiny portraits are killing me. Uh, was only in this version. But it's been, uh, Mountain Man Jed managed to, uh, sort of port this mode into, uh, into Revenge. So you can play this on the, on the MVS version of Revenge. There's actually like a, uh, whoa, you can, wow, I didn't know you could air throw off that now. So you can actually, uh, play this on Fightcade. <laughs> it's just pure chaos. It's not something you're gonna, like, uh, take seriously. It's just kinda, it's just kinda fun to fuck around with. Oh yeah, you've got super cancels. <laughs> oh man, the wake up games.
No, my breaker. <laughs> Man, Show's jump jab was already like kind of kind of weird. What <laughs> ya? I think you can probably combo off that. Oh wow, you can do jump jab and uh, air throw. Don't run into that. But yeah, it's it's goofy. I need to see that Condor animation. That's the only animation I haven't seen. But yeah, I guess when uh, when Visco like put this game on the back burner or put Crystal Legacy on the back burner after how how bad the initial version was, they just kind of. They just kind of went ham, like trying like everything they could put into a fighting game. Whoa, that's a that's would have been a cool combo if it what if it actually worked. Jesus! Oh my God, Rala! I can't get over the fact that the computer knows how to push block. <laughs> unsafe on hit. Everything is unsafe on hit. Also, yeah, that means like everything is everything is bufferable. Sixty-nine. Wait, what? She can cancel spinning claw into the into the... or not Spinning Claw. The dash attack in the Spinning Claw. Damn it, what a punish. What an answer. Damn, I should have played Rylo in this mode. But yeah, this shit's completely nuts, and the only official version it was on was the, uh, was this Neo CD version. Since Revenge, uh, did not get a port until the, uh, I guess the Breakers collection. Whoa! <laughs> god damn! Oh god. I can't get over the fact that the computer like knows how to like guard cancel or not guard cancel uh, uh, alpha counter. Oh, again, I'm saying the wrong thing. Push block. This is a lot going on in this game. My mind's uh, my mind's scrambled. Uh, where's my super? Oh, you can cancel the spin and the fireball. Smash it too much. Damn it. Nice. Yeah, PL can just cancel anything. He's actually, like, pretty legit in this mode. Oh, I'm trying to fight Condor. <laughs> Immediate push block. <laughs> Oops. Uh -oh. 
<laughs> I gotta remember, I can actually like ABC cancel out if I get hit. But it costs a bar. <laughs> oh yeah, Tia's nuts, of course, in this mode. Oh, she can juggle after that. Of course. Oh, she's mashing. Luckily, I'm a masher, too. So yeah, this mode is just... It's just fun. It's insane fun. But not something you're really going to take all that seriously. Just fun to fuck around with in, in short, uh, short doses. I was trying to dive kick after the hurricane kick. I couldn't do it. Oh god, Marl! Oh no, double Baluno! Double Baluno! Yo, Baluno Infinite? Okay. I picked the wrong character. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Ah, no! Baluno! Fuck it, I'm just mashing. I mean, that's always my philosophy, but... Fuck it, I'm just mashing. <laughs> Why would you ABC cancel that? Unfortunately, the computer doesn't doesn't seem to have a good answer for a slow fireball. <laughs> what the hell was that frame I got hit on? There's Condor. Oh, you see his ass for a second. What the? He's being cute. Alright, CPU Condor, show me some shit. Uh. Oh god. Oh no! <laughs> okay. Condor's mashing even harder than me. Okay. Oh, trade combos. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> that auto corrected. No, you can't go through that. Yeah, I'm just amazed they, like, programmed in the computer, like, looking for opportunities to push block. Like, I'm pretty sure the, uh, the version of this that was ported into Revenge, like, the computer also just, just kind of goes nuts with, with all the mechanics. Like, it's just funny to me, the, the CPU, like, knows what to do. Poison. Double push block? Double chili, if you win. Fuck, I can't get in. Oh god, he's got an air throw combo, too. Alright, back to fireballs, I guess. I don't know why that hit. What is CPU Baihu gonna do? Oh god. Oh god. And he can jump cancel that. Ah, uh, at least my super. 
Computer has no qualms about using all its meter to to cancel out of hit stun. Okay. Oh, that's an overhead. Harmony. Harmony. I can't anti air that. There we go. No! I didn't mean to jump cancel. Earn that one, I guess. Oh, they, they don't show the Baihu intro if you have simple mode turned on. Oh, they don't have a a weird portrait for Baihu. A weird animation for Baihu. Come on, Visco, step it up. Oh god, what the fuck do I do? Mugen! Oh my god, he can just cancel out of that? How do I land like any hits? Oh god. Oh my god. The bad manner backdash? Uh oh. Okay. You push block my fireball. Hey. Oh god, what a what a punish. Oh my god. Oh, he could have done some sick shit there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No! Got full meter. Yeah! This is gonna save, but that's alright. <laughs> the disembodied hair and eye of show. I forgot all about this ending. I always play Ryla. I, <laughs> I don't remember anything about show's ending. Endings are just kind of, kind of, eh. And the endings weren't changed from from Breakers to Revenge either, so. Data save. Um, sure. Game over. Okay, I just want to see how many balloonos you can do with, uh, with Marl. There's no, uh, training mode. They put in survival mode, but not training mode. I hope it's still set on extra. God, that... Why does he stick out his tongue? <laughs> Aren't I kawaii? Ain't I a stinker? Wait, did it turn off? Uh... No. How did the computer do two balonos in a row? I 
I swear the computer, like, cancelled it. Cancelled Baluno into Baluno. Baluno into Commander Super? Oh, shit. Commander Super is 360 with kick, right? Doesn't seem to be working. Oh. Nah, it doesn't seem to be working. Did he? Wow. Did Peter just cancel into out of blocks now? Might be a very, very tight timing window. Like it only happened when he did the uh, uh, the hit stun cancel. Computer knowing how to do all this shit. How do you do the, uh, there we go. Good lord. I'm just trying to do the command throw server. <laughs> oh, yeah, the claw. Can't do the command throw super. Yeah, I was doing 360s with kick. So having, like, air chains available means, like, yeah, you can just do the, the jump jab claw and then cancel it into whatever. Oh no, it's not active the entire time. I thought it was. It's active for a long time, but not long enough. There we go. That's all I wanted to do. Alright, I'll, I'll let PL have a dub. We need to... I think we need to move on. <laughs> but yeah. Not taking into account the uh <laughs> the the stupidity of uh of extra mode in uh in CD breakers. The uh the original breakers is not a game that you see like anybody Nobody really plays the original breakers because revenge just made it uh uh, just kind of invalidated its existence, but, uh... Original Breakers is still a good game. I think when, uh, when Revenge... When, when Revenge happens, like, it's just gonna be, like, rated, like... One spot above or something. <laughs> I don't know, there's... it's... Holy shit, PL! Damn! CPU PL putting on a, a combo video. Of course, none of this is legit if I just start mashing. Because you can you can definitely mash out of it. <laughs> you can do whatever you want to get out of it. It's just it's just funny seeing the CPU do all this stuff. Wow, this looks really shitty. Five, four, three, two, one. Really shitty. Wins! Oh, Dumple John, thank you for the 61 months. <laughs> I 
<laughs> versus combo hack of Athena. Thing about combo hack though is that you can't like escape once you're in a combo. This game is just kind of. It would be funny to see like what kind of combos you could do if you couldn't actually uh, get out. You can once around. You'd pay me a hundred dollars for an in-depth fundamental guide for beat 'em ups. Well, <laughs> beat 'em ups are kind of like a lot of them play differently. It's hard to cover like every fundamental when when every game has like different different fundamentals. Also, I'm very bad at video guides. That's why I, I stream <laughs> and just. And just toss these uh, these highlights onto onto YouTube. Anyway. Show music on. Well, well, the things I uploaded to that that old website, those weren't videos. I imagine this is wanting like a video guide. I mean, I haven't done like much much long form writing like that in a while, but anyway. Uh, what do we think about breakers? Where is this gonna? Where is this gonna go on the list? Above fire's history, dynamite. Oh, you've made a powerful enemy today. No. Um. <laughs> Twenty-nine. I, I don't know about that. This is definitely higher than that. Ten, maybe fifteen. Ten, ten. 11, 17, 15, 12, 16, 22, 16. I can definitely, I can definitely see a, see a case for this being like number 10. Again, RNG, this, I'm not good at producing video guides. This is, this is why I, I do these streams, because I'm not good at video editing. It's much, it's much easier for me to do this long-form long stuff. And if I did video guides, I'd have to spend less time streaming, so... That's yeah, not gonna happen, sorry. 20, 15, 15, 12, 9, 25, 17, 15... 27? 25, yeah, some people don't, uh... I seem to like this. 16? 15? 15. Is it better than World Heroes Perfect? Eh. I've spent a lot more time playing, well, Breaker's Revenge. I spent a lot more time playing the Breaker's series than World Heroes Perfect. So I think. I feel like it should be higher than World Heroes Perfect. But that's just me. I don't know. We seem to be uh, we seem to be very split. over the place. Um, some people think it's better than World Heroes Perfect, some people think it's worse. I thought for sure we were gonna, like, uh, put it into, like, top 10. <laughs> At 10th place, at least. But...
I guess that's the, uh, the thing about Breakers. Like, it's not really... Other than, like, extra mode being just fucking do whatever the fuck you feel like, like, the game doesn't really... Uh... Doesn't really do anything, like, new and exciting or super special. But it plays well. Like, some people have made the comparison that, like, uh, Breakers is, like, the closest thing to Street Fighter Alpha on the, uh, on the Neo Geo. Although, it plays a lot better than Street Fighter Alpha 1, if we're gonna be real here. And yeah, it has, it has nice controls, it's really easy to, to, to jump in and pick up. There's no, there's no super, super janky weirdness with the, with the move detection. It feels good to just, like, run around and press buttons, which is a very important thing to have in a fighting game. So, I think... I think we're gonna put it, like, yeah, either, like, somewhere in this range, from 15 to 17, then. Some people want it higher, some people want it lower, we gotta... We gotta average it out. Um. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm scrolling back through the uh, the chat. Settle on the uh, like uh, on sixteen. Well, the thing is, when when Revenge comes out, like Revenge is like almost entirely the same game. Like it's not going to be like that much higher on the list because Revenge is like almost exactly the same game, just with like one more character, one more boss that's playable. People keep talking about these supposed gameplay differences between Breakers and Revenge, but I'm still... <laughs> I've still never seen, like, anybody produce a list. I don't know. Well, we'll worry about that when... Uh, when we get into 1998, I guess. I think we're just gonna leave this at 16 for now. 16. Crankman2000, thank you for the 43 months. There's AI differences in single player. 